Okay, how do I start? I guess I'll just cut the fluff and get straight to the point. I am embarking on a new journey and I welcome you to join me. When my no plan B journey came to an end back in November, I didn't really know if I was going to embark on a new self-development journey or just do life without putting a name on it. I learned so much from that journey and I solidified a pretty well-established lifestyle that was a no-brainer for me to continue regardless of the journey coming to an end. But the thought in question was, what will I do next? What do I want to do next? Do I want to start this whole new thing or just see where life takes me? And I chose the latter. Like I said, I didn't really have much in mind about what I was going to do next. I was just going to see whatever happens and go with the flow. And that's exactly what happened in a let me here. I came across this IG reel and I can't seem to find this video anywhere, but basically it asked, what would happen if you gave your absolute all and everything for one year? So that made me wonder, what would happen if I gave my absolute all and everything for one year? I wanna find out. So for the year of 2023, I am embarking on an absolute all journey and this is what it's all about. The absolute all journey is about giving your absolute all and everything for one year. You must become obsessed and dedicated to building the life you want. You cannot make excuses and be lazy and you need to operate with uninterrupted focus and prioritize growth. The purpose of an absolute all journey is to change your life. It is a time investment to turn your life 180 in 365 days. For the next 12 months, you will intentionally place yourself in discomfort, actively seek for learning experiences, and rise above limitations. The journey lasts for one year, just one, and you need to be at a high level of standards for yourself. Or in other words, you have to be hard on yourself. An absolute all journey is not for everyone. Not everyone is willing or wanting to dedicate one year of their life to being extremely hard on themselves and to doing things that they don't wanna do at all. And it's absolutely okay for you to say that this journey is not for you. Self-development does not have a schedule to it. It doesn't have an how-to sheet to it. It is very personal and it's whatever you want it to be. So if you want to be more relaxed and take things slowly, or if you're especially new to self-development, then it's okay if this journey is not for you. I actually think you might reap the benefits of the No Plan B journey, which is only six months. I'll link everything you need to know about that journey down below. I highly suggest you to watch the first and last video of that journey and take advantage of the Notion page. It's extremely important to document your growth and I'll get more into that later. An absolute journey will change your life. And you may be wondering, how can you be so sure? Well, I successfully completed the No Plan B journey and that experience showed me in my own records and research how lives change. It proved to me that we can achieve anything we want if we put our minds to it. And it gave me a sense of certainty and trusting I can give myself everything I want. And I always say this, if others can do it, you can do it. And if others can't, you can still do it. So if I can, you certainly can. To fully reap the rewards of this journey, you have to document it. So just like the No Plan B journey, I created an absolute all journey notion page where we will measure growth, track our progress, and monitor where we are in the journey so we know how to move forward. Every section of the notion page has its very own purpose. And I've put a lot of time and thought into making this template because I want it to be useful. Right at the start of the template, you're asked to reflect on the journey and what you want to get out of it. When you go into the Notion page, you'll see that I've left little notes within each toggle to help you answer each question. And you'll see this pattern throughout the template. You'll see that I leave little notes and explanations for you to help you basically really utilize this template and take full advantage of it. Moving down, we have a goal progress section where you'll basically take the goals that you've listed in the toggles and write them here. Keep in mind that this is not a goal planning strategy section. I don't want you to make a master plan on how you're going to achieve this goal. I want you guys to execute it. I want you guys to take the initial steps first and then come back here to the section and write down your actions, write down the methods used, write down what worked and what didn't, then go out there and act on it more. And I want this repetitive cycle to continue with your goals. I don't want you to plan out your goals. Like sure, have an idea, but don't have everything listed out and have the strategy. The most important thing is for you to take your initial step. That's it. So stop thinking and start acting. Next up, we have a thought audit section. And you can basically treat this as a journal. You log whatever thought you have throughout this journey that you deem significant. This is a place where you're going to do some thought auditing. Thought auditing is different from thought dumping. When it comes to thought auditing, I want you guys to question and challenge your thoughts. I also want you to analyze it. And once you understand it, I want you guys 
to let it go. You don't need to hold on to your thoughts. The brain is for processing, not remembering everything. All right, moving on, we have the knowledge nook. So in this section, I want you guys to treat it as a notebook. I want you guys to take notes on any educational resources or knowledge that you're going to come across throughout this journey. You want to know what contributed to your growth and make sense of that. So collect any of the wisdom and knowledge you come across throughout the journey right here in the section. There are other features too, such as a book bank, a monthly reflection section, monthly prompts that I give you, and so much more. I've revised this Notion page so many times already, and I'm actually currently using it right now to test it out. And I gotta say, I'm very excited for you guys to see it and to try out yourself. And I'm even more excited to start the journey with you guys. A dear, dear friend of mine, Annie Long, who is also here on YouTube, you guys probably already know her, she is joining us as well. She has a related video on setting goals and how to execute them. I'm so appreciative to be invited to share my thoughts on goal setting in her video. So check it out and listen closely to what Annie has to say. I always learn so much from her. And if you're curious about my personal Notion page, then you might want to check out my newsletter, Sunday Scribbles. It is totally free to read. And in my latest issue, I go over my toggle points and what I'll be doing to change my life. And of course, I'll be documenting my entire journey the entire year here on YouTube and also on my Instagram and TikTok at elizvichu. So if you want to stay up to date with the useful content and resources that I'm going to share with you guys, subscribe and give me a follow. I really appreciate it. By now, I hope you are convinced to join me on this journey and build the life you love. An absolute all journey will make you exceptionally good at what you do. If six months of deep internal work can change lives, think about what one year can do. And the last thing I want to mention, and I think this is the most important point that I want to make, is that this journey is not going to participate in that toxic hustle culture. That is not what this journey is about. In the same way that we are going to be intense on how we work ourselves, we're also going to be intense on the way that we love and take care of ourselves. Feel free to gradually ease into the journey so you can have a smoother and more successful transition. And always, always, always put health over anything else. Nothing is more important than your health and well-being. If you don't have a healthy body, you can't do anything. And most importantly, have lots and lots and lots of fun. Cherish the journey, make many memories, and appreciate every present moment. All right, that is all I have for you for now. I can't wait to embark on this new journey with you guys and see where it takes us. Remember to keep your head where your feet are and take it one step at a time. Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you guys very soon. Bye-bye.